on the Medical Watch this afternoon. Concerns over vampire bacteria. Medical reporter Dina Baer is here to explain exactly what that means, Dina. So deadly bacteria can feed on human blood, which is why researchers have called it vampire bacteria. Washington state scientists found in order to grow, bacteria like salmonella and E. coli gravitate toward nutrient-rich amino acids in the blood. It's the reason bacteria flock to the bloodstream, causing potentially fatal infections. Using high-powered microscopes, the researchers documented the rapid movement of bacteria towards serum in the body. The study could lead to the development of medications to treat blood infections and, more importantly, prevent the bacteria from taking hold in the first place. Deeper sedation may be the prescription for a better colonoscopy. When patients are in a deeper state, doctors can more efficiently detect certain polyps. The result, according to a study in the Journal of the American Society of Anesthesiologists, superior cancer detection and prevention. The study showed propofol provided higher quality colonoscopy than conscious sedation. Serrated polyps are difficult to detect precancerous lesions. Nearly all colon cancers start as small growths called polyps. Identifying them and removing them prevents them from developing into cancer. As technology becomes more readily available in medicine, doctors may have better tools to defeat disease. University of Cambridge scientists, for example, say artificial intelligence has sped up the ability to identify Parkinson's disease treatments. AI accelerates the search for medications to relieve Parkinson's symptoms by 10 times, according to the researchers. AI rapidly found compounds to block the clumping of a protein associated with Parkinson's decline. The Cambridge team used machine learning to screen an entire library of millions of entries, ultimately finding five highly potent compounds for further investigation. The team is pretty excited about their research, and they point to the possibilities for AI to aid in finding relief for other huge, ailments as huge, well. Yeah. We had to see this coming, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. And now Absolutely. it's actually coming to fruition. Okay. Thank you so much, Dina. Up next.